and welcome to Fact Today, the series where I bring you at least one fact every single day for as long as possible. Now today's fact is why popcorn actually pops. But first let's look at the anatomy of a corn kernel. In a corn kernel we have four main components. We have the pericap, which is the outer shell, the endosperm, which is basically starch inside of it, the germ, which is actually the part that grows into a plant if you plant the corn kernel, and the tin cap that connects the kernel to the cob. Now onto how corn kernels actually pop. Now these corn kernels have about 13 to 14% water in them. When you heat up this water, it's usually around 400 degrees Fahrenheit, which is enough to boil this water and turn it from a liquid into steam. Since the steam has a volume of about 50 times more than in its liquid state, there's a lot of pressure that builds up inside this kernel. Eventually, the force generated by this pressure is too much for the pericap to handle, so it bursts. When it breaks, you hear a popping sound, and the steam escapes, which pushes the kernel around on itself. And then you see the inside, which was cooked by the boiling water before it popped. Now as a side fact, let's look at why some popcorn doesn't pop. Every corn kernel has different amounts of water. If one has too little water, there's not enough steam to pop the kernel. And if it has too much water, it'll pop early, making it uncooked. And on top of that, every pear cap is different strength, so when it breaks, it may be uncooked or it may be burnt. But that's today's fact. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up. I'd very much appreciate it. And subscribe if you'd like to hear more daily facts. And as always, thanks for watching, and until next time, have a good day.